Hi, I'm Emily, and this is Gigi. And today, Archie. Archie. And this is Kitchenasium. Today we're going to be making pinata out of party hats. Yay! So we've got candy and all kinds of different things. And confetti. Yes. Do both sides. You got to do both sides, and as close as you can without cutting it. You're going to take it off because we're not using these as party hats today. We're making pinatas. We have some ribbon. So we're going to line it up like this. So both of the ends meet, but they don't have to be perfect, okay? And then we're going to take this side that kind of looks like how they put it together. Can you help so, me? This side. Okay, yeah. So you're going to put it, look, Gigi, you're going to take this end, the one that you just fold them in half. So they, you have two pieces on the bottom and fold it in half. And then look, you're just going to feed it through. See? Now look, it's in here, and you're just going to pull it out. And now tape it. Now, so then... We have two pieces like this, and that's how we're going to hang them. And then, if you want to test it to make sure it doesn't. Okay. And now next, we get to fill it with the candy. Candy! So now we're just going to... And some fatty. Yeah. So now we're just going to put candy in here. Probably about an inch from the top. And we are using our temptations with all of our party, because they're not just for cooking. You can also do them for crafts. Okay. How about I just sprinkle the rest in? <laughs> Not so much. They're going to come up very, um, I want a little bit more. Thank you. Yay. This is probably the best part. <laughs> we don't really have a lot left for our other ones. <laughs> so now we're going to take these. These cut into circles, as you can see, they are not perfect. Then you kind of make an X so the candy will fall out because we're going to be pulling, not whacking. Okay. Yeah. So now you're going to take this, right, and you're going to put it on top of the party hat, and then we're going to take tape. Take tape. So now we're going to be taking tape, and make sure you leave enough on the sides to tape it down. Ask a parent or a guardian to help you with this part. <laughs> This takes two people usually, but it doesn't matter if you put a lot of tape or it gets messy because we're going to cover it in these, so they're all pretty and cool. Now we put the tissue paper that we put a little X for the candy to fall out. Now we are going to be taking an end of our ribbon. Give me a second. Let me do this. We're going to be taking the end of our ribbon and a piece of tape. Alrighty. So your candy. Just like that. Uh, Alrighty, we're doing yours now. So the candy won't fall out. Exactly. Hope oh, well. Okay, we're gonna need more tape. If you if you don't do this and your candy falls out, well, you don't have any pinata, you have to start over again. Ta -da. Ta -da. And now we're going to decorate tissue paper and we folded it up like this and then we cut little slices, not all the way down, it look like fringes. Just cutting them, take this and you can cut it to fit yours or make it overlap. Now with the tissue paper it's kind of a soft colors that we're using. You can use any colors you want where you can make it overlap or cut it to fit perfectly. Overlapping will give you more color. Can to eat? Well, we're going to be using glue. Gigi. But we're using glue. Using tape. Okay, she's using glue. Tape. I'll be using glue. Now, if you want um, the instructions to make this, it's on the chew.com. You can go and look for some of their amazing recipes, or you can search for the pinata uh, party hats. So you can get what you need. This is how many tape I used. <laughs> yes, yeah, she used tape, and they used for the chew. They used glue, so you start from the bottom and work your way up, and there's the start of mine. But now you just get to decorate it the way you like. You can use any colors, maybe for your themed party, whatever colors for your theme that you're doing. Or if you want, you could do the same as us. Yes, exactly. For 4th of July, you can make 4th of July pinatas and do red, white, and blue, which would be super cool. For Easter, you can do screen colors. And for uh, Halloween, you can put black, um, orange, orange. For Valentine's, you can do.
do pink and red. Yes. This is so much fun for birthday parties. You could even do it where you could do it as a party craft. And you could have like the kids make it and then they get to open their pinata they made. Or take it home as a party favor. And then smash it. Well these ones are more of the pull ones. This is how mine came out. Oh wow. Can't wait to trigger this. To trigger it? Yeah, pull it down. Then you hang it up and pull. Gigi, was this a fun craft? Yep. And you got a lot to do. Oh, I don't have that much. Over there. Oh, over there. using for all of this is Temptations because it's so awesome to use especially not just for cooking as you can see we're crafting with it we have the party hats here we got the tissue paper the candy just so much fun you have a little bit more to go done Wait. these have turned out super awesome I think so cool and the candies in there, it's just super awesome. And it was really easy to make. Are you ready to break them open now? <laughs> One, two, three, go! One, two, three, go! to the party hat pinatas go to the chew.com and they'll tell you everything you need to get it but this is how you do it we're just showing the video 